Hi, welcome to lesson 28, session three, develop making teen numbers. All right, we're going to start on page 557. And as you get your page set up, I need you to also get all of your cubes out because you will be building some teen numbers on these empty tens frames. And then you'll need something to write with because then we're going to fill in the number bonds and the addition statements, okay? Now I'm going to begin by showing you some filled in tens frames. And I want you to build this with your cubes in these empty tens frames. And I'm gonna hold this up here while you build yours. And then I'm gonna come in and fill in mine using my cube so you can see what it should look like, okay? So this is our first tens frame. And what you'll notice is this here is a completed tens frame, and then there are some extras in the second tens frame. Okay, so what that's gonna look like on your paper when you build, and um, just go ahead and build and not uh, color in at this point, because you're going to be doing two problems. Okay. All right, I'm going to be multitasking here. So I'm gonna fill in my tens frames, and you should be following along with your cubes to build the number that I am showing you up here on the board. Okay. First, use all of your yellows to fill the top row of the first tens frame. And then use your, your red cubes to fill in the bottom of that first tens frame. So now you have a total of 10. And then when we look at our extras, take a look at this one right here and count how many extras you need. And you're going to use your green cubes to show that. Now, if you have already counted the extras, you should have three green cubes on your page. Okay. So this is what your page should look like. <clears throat> Excuse me. When you build it on your own sheet on page 557. You should have all of your yellows and all of your reds in the first tens frame, followed by your three green extras. Now we're going to come down here to this first number bond, and we're going to show what teen number we just made. And in order to do that, we need to see how many are in each tens frame. Okay, so we know that teen numbers are made up of a group of 10. Down here, you're going to write 10. And then we had. Very good, three extras. So you're going to write three. So when we look at the bond, okay, you have 10 and three. When you put those together, that makes the teen number 13. You take the one, meaning you have one group of 10, and the three from the three extras. Now let's look at that as an addition statement. Let's look underneath, it says blank plus blank equals blank. Now I know that's scary because there's nothing there, but it's very simple because we're going to use the bond that we just wrote and make the addition statement. So watch what I do. 10 from right here plus the 3 equals 13. So it's actually very simple. You did all the work already and then you just split it up to show an addition statement. So let's take a look at another teen number, okay? I'm going to show you this teen number right here. You have your full group of 10, which we already have. You already have your yellows and reds, but now you have some more. We don't only have three now. So I want you to count these dots and I'll count with you to see how many extras there are, okay, ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so now we're gonna make sure we have seven of those cubes in our extras, okay? <clears throat> so we have 13. In order to get seven, we have to fill up the whole top five. Uh oh. And then we need to get some extra. So we have five, 
six and seven. So now your tens frame, oh, the wrong number, your tens frame should look like this. So on ours, these are yellow, red, our greens, and then we put some purples here, okay? Now let's make that into a number bond. We know we have a group of 10, so let's begin by writing our 10 and our extras. How many extras did we just show? Come back here and look at your greens and your purples, and all together we had seven. So what is 10 and seven extras? That makes the teen number 17. So now let's look at that as an addition statement. 10 plus 7 equals, you got it, 17. You had it at the very top of your number bond already. You had all the answers there for you. Very good. All right, so we're going to flip this over and take another look at our teen numbers. All right, paste that in here. And I'm going to crop out some of this so we don't have all the distractions. And now we're looking at page 558, okay? On this page, you have three different sets of numbers. They're all divided by these long lines. So we're only going to look at one row at a time. So don't let that uh, distract you from what you're working on. We're going to work on the first one where we have a set of 10 blue and we have some extra reds. So what it's going to want us to do is fill in the number bond. It says we have 10 blue and 4 red. Together we have 14. So you're going to trace that 14. Okay, 10 and 4 extras is 14. All right, let's look at the one in the middle. We have 10 blue, and they already put that in our number bond. And then let's look at how many red we have. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So they put 5 red. Now we need to figure out what teen number is made up of a group of 10 and 5 extras. Start with the one from the 10, one group of 10, and then your five. What teen number did we just write? Great job, that's a 15, okay? Now at the bottom, it wants you to do the addition statement, okay? What do we have here in blue? How many? All right, that's all right. We have a group of 10, now I want you to count how many red circles are in the second tens frame. Go ahead and pause if you need to, to count. That's right, there are eight reds. You're gonna write the eight here to show that 10 plus eight equals, and then you're gonna trace the T number, 18. And hopefully you can trace it a lot nicer than Ms. Torres can. But we just showed that 10 plus 8 equals 18. All right, let's look at the next page. Okay, your next page is 559. I'm going to bring that over here. All right. They have something very similar over here on this page where you're going to do each row at a time. The first one has the example for you where they want you to trace a group of 10 and one more is, that's right, 11. So trace the 11. Now I want you to do these next two on your own. I'm not going to write up here, but I will talk you through it, okay? In the second problem, you have a group of 10, a full group of 10 here. So you see the 10 here on this number bond. And then in this tens frame, they have some red extras. There are one, two, three extras. So you can see the three over here. 
Now they want you to use the number bond to build the teen number using the bond 10 and three extras. Okay, so pause if you need to and write what teen number is made of a group of 10 and three extras. And now finally at the bottom, they have your group of 10 blue dots in the tens frame and they wrote that over here in the bond, but then they're missing the other half. Which color will you write here? So right, you're going to count your reds, your extras, and write them here. So let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So you have seven extras. So you're going to write the seven over here. I'll do this one with you. And then now decide what ten and seven extras makes, which T number is made up of ten and seven extras. Again, pause the video if you need to, and then we'll be ready for the last page of today's activity. Okay, so when you flip your page over, you're now on 560, and we're going to do the addition statements now. So if you need to make your number bonds, that's not a bad idea. I'm going to do this first one with you and show how to make a number bond, and then I'll talk you through the next two, okay? So, I see a group of 10. Let me make my number bonds. If you'd like to do this and follow along, you go right ahead. But I do see a group of 10 here, so I'm going to fill in my bond with a 10. And then over here I see two extras. So I'm gonna write a two in this bond, okay? So 10 and two makes up the teen number 12. So I'm gonna look at that as an addition statement. 10 plus, we have two red extras. Together that makes, 12. Excellent. So let's look at the next one. How many blues fill up this tens frame? That's right, you're 10. And so here's the 10 right here. If you want to make a number bond, you absolutely can. How many extras are there? Pause the video to count if you need extra time. Okay, I see one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we have 10 plus nine. So you're going to fill in the nine right here. I'm not going to do it. I want to see how you can fill in your addition statement. 10 plus nine equals what is the T number when you have 10 and nine extras? Finally, you have one more group down here. I see a group of 10 blue dots and some red extras. Just like the last two problems, I want you to fill in the addition statement to find the teen number that is represented by these dots, okay? So hopefully this video has helped you and we will see you in the next one.